Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. Welcome to today's video. There is nothing better than chamomile tea when we are stressed out or need a good night's rest. But what are its health benefits? What does science say? What are the experiments or what are the, the what's the data that exists about chamomile? Believe it or not, a lot of times we hear Oh, it's not scientifically proven, right? But there is a lot of evidence out there, a lot of evidence of which today we are going to discover. What is chamomile good for? What are its health benefits based on science and how you can use it to improve your health and the loved ones in your home or the ones you love around you. All right, so first of all, what is chamomile? A lot of people have never seen chamomile, and it's a, it's a it's small plant, if you want to call it a herb, but it has the most effective part to it is a flower, and a very beautiful flower for that matter. This is the part of that plant that contains all the ingredients that have, have the health benefits that are gonna help you improve your health. Okay, so chamomile, the flower, and this is what you make out of, this is what you do, this is what we uh, what we use as tea, chamomile tea, when we prepare it every day at home. So what is it good for? What are the science-based data or evidence we have? Well, first of all, we all know chamomile is excellent for going to bed, going to sleep, and it's been proven to help people sleep for thousands of years. It's been used all around the world in every country you can name of. Chamomile tea is excellent for sleep and excellent for people suffering from insomnia. Conclusions of this study, you can go and read it later, but the oral administration of chamomile extract has a set of effect or properties in great quality sleep of hospitalized elderly patients, which are the hardest patients to help sometimes because their bodies are not functioning properly. So you might want to give chamomile a try. If you need something natural that can help you sleep better every night and at the same time have an antioxidant effect on your body, repairing your nerves, your circulatory system, and your immune function. Look for melatonin from Fineland at FinelandVitamins.com. All right, what else is chamomile good for? Well, chamomile is an antidepressant also. Not many people don't know that. When you take chamomile to go to bed every night or you take it every day before going to rest or to sleep, it also has an antidepressant activity in the body. A lot of people today suffer from depression, from anxiety. Well, you might want to try chamomile as chamomile extra or chamomile tea. All right, results. Again, conclusion. Chamomile may provide clinically meaningful antidepressant activities that occurs in addition to its previous observed anti-anxiolytic activity. So instead of taking something that might keep you all sedated, well, you can try chamomile tea that will help you rest and at the same time, keep your body going so that you you don't have those de depressive symptoms that you might be having every day. If you need something natural that can actually push your body up and energize your system, look for metathyroid or oxy elixir from Finland at drlandnevara.com. I take oxy elixir every day. It's the extract of a very special fruit from India that is just spectacular. Let me see if I can find it. Well, I, I can't find it. Well, I'll show it to you later. All right, number three, what is chamomile good for? Again, another health benefits not many people know. Many women, I'd say most women sometimes, the ones we might know, have menstrual cramps and menstrual bleeding. Well, chamomile can also help decrease dysmenorrhea, which is the effect of uh, too much or excessive bleeding when that time of the month, when the, that time of the month comes by. And sometimes due to uh, maybe insulin resistance or hormone imbalance or even um, polycystic ovarian syndrome. Well, you can try chamomile. Based on the results of most review studies, chamomile can be considered as an effective treatment for primary dysmenorrhea and reducing menstrual bleeding. So if you're one of those women, you might want to give it a try. It might help you. And if you're not a woman, if you're male, well, check out this next benefit. This will help you a great deal. If you need something natural that can help you with a good regulatory system with respects to hormone imbalance, look for myo-inositol and apolizer from Finland at drlandnevar.com. All right, number four, chamomile is excellent as an hepatoprotective herb. You can use it as tea. I, I use it actually with my with my patients. I use it at night. If you if I see that someone has, for example, a fatty liver or has problems with their liver, I tell them to take or cinnamon tea or chamomile tea every night, nonstop during six months, maybe a year. It is spectacular for reducing inflammation and has a hepatoprotective effect on our liver. So you might want to give it a try. If you have any problem with cholesterol, liver, inflammation, you have problems 
problems with liver damage of any sort, you want that hepatoprotective effect of chamomile tea or chamomile extract, all right? Excellent, excellent, excellent. Number five, repeated again the effect of chamomile, not only with the anti-inflammatory effect of the liver, but also your digestive system. A lot of people have problems with digestion. Anything we eat might cause, cause us constipation or, or colics or inflammation or pain. Well, you might want to try chamomile. Chamomile can also help you. There are many, many studies to support the fact it has a gene expression inhibiting effect on the activation and has an effect anti-inflammatory effect or agent on our system so give it a try you might want to use it if you have any type of pain or stomach condition all right don't forget that natural substances can help your body cope with situations and sometimes can even reverse the problems you might have so if you have problems with inflammation in your system you might want to try chamomile for a long period of time it's not going to do something just immediately that day and cure you but it might help you out in the long run all right okay Number six or number seven. Now, this is a chart that I want to show you because this is actually a study where uh, there is a very wide range of, of health benefits being named. So it has an anti-diuretic real effect, anti-spasmodic. I just talked about that, right? Uh, as a cosmetic, it's also been used. It's also proven to be very effective. I have more up here. Let me see. Let me check. Okay. A genital protective effect, a gastroprotective effect, nephroprotective effect, meaning kidneys. Okay. So if you have problems with your kidneys, you might want to try camo. Also, it has a diuretic effect and in, in synthesis, a organoprotective effect on your body. There are many, many other health benefits or chamomile. If you need to take it, I'd say you take it very very strong in tea form maybe three to five bags in one cup of hot water and you take that before going to bed warning it's not going to help you sleep very well because it's going to keep you going to the bathroom all night but it has a very important sedative effect that will help you rest the hours that you are sleeping so if you need something natural that can help you with problems with your stomach with inflammation or improving digestion look for colopgon gi balance and d enzymes from finelanded finelanded vitamins.com there you have it take chamomile every time every 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 once in a while it will help you with many problems and give this video a like button if you need some someone else if you want to share with someone else go ahead and i will see you in the next video